guys. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. For the next five weeks, I will be training super hard and eating clean. I have decided that for the past two months, I've really let myself go, I've gained a lot of weight, I've just been relaxing and not really thinking about what I'm eating or exercising regularly. So I've decided I'm gonna be exercising every single day with possible rest days on Sundays and eating as clean as possible. So the plan is we're gonna be starting on a Wednesday, which is tomorrow. I have been doing it this week, like Monday, Tuesday, but not properly really. That's running all the way through my exam period and post that as well. So in terms of exercise, I'm gonna be doing half an hour of either Pilates, running, or some sort of cardio hit or weight training workout every single morning. So half an hour is doable. I'm not trying to push myself too much. I'm just gonna be starting slow. And this is just for the first week. And then I'm gonna see how I feel and whether I should increase or whether I need more time to sleep or revise. And then at half an hour in the evening, I'm gonna be doing yoga. That will really just make me stretched out for bedtime and calm before I go to sleep because I have been having sleeping troubles as well. So that is one of my goals, which I will come on to later. And now we're going to talk about diet. So basically, I haven't been eating well at all. Coming back from work late because I started working at a bar called Walkabout, which is just around the corner from me. And I get back from work at like 2 a.m. sometimes. And all I want is just like some cheesy chips from the shop, so I've been getting them. And I decided that that needs to stop. So I'm basically gonna be eating some sort of like cereal for breakfast, maybe some porridge, some fruit and nuts, something to really start my day well. Going to try and not snack too much and try and reduce my caffeine intake. So I really wanna cut down on the coffee and become less reliant on it and the Coke, both big parts of my life. Obviously there will be days when I'll just really need a cup of coffee or a bottle of coke and I will have one but hopefully generally it'll be minimized. For lunch and dinner I'm going to be doing really healthy clean meals not cutting out carbs altogether. I will be having stuff like rice healthy carbs like that but trying to get most of my carbs from fruit and vegetables trying to cut out sugar as much as possible and processed food and just be eating a lot of lean protein and vegetables. When I actually show you my breakdown of my week, you'll see exactly what I'm eating, but for now I'm unsure. I'm getting a lot of my meals from the Deliciously Ella book, which I actually got from my ex's mum and I love it. It's mainly vegan and it's just got some really good delicious whole recipes in there. I'm gonna be drinking a lot of like herbal caffeine free tea just to get me through my day because I do just like a cup of hot something. It's like a routine for me every morning. I like a cup of hot coffee or every afternoon. Goals are to sleep better, so to sleep earlier and to wake up earlier to improve my posture because I have quite bad neck problems and I feel like a lot of it is to do with how I train and how much I exercise. So hopefully the yoga every night will really improve my posture. I wanna improve my skin. I have quite bad redness all here on my cheeks. Clean eating, lots of water drinking and lots of herbal tea. And confidence is my last one. I just really want to be more confident in my body. I want to be more toned, not necessarily skinnier or lighter. I'm not gonna be weighing myself at any point during this. I just want to feel confident in my body and hopefully that will then reflect outwards in terms of my personality and all other parts of my life too. I think that is all I have to say. I really hope that you enjoy this video and I really hope that I can keep this up for five weeks because it's not even day one yet and I'm pretty scared, I won't lie. I hope you like being with me on this journey. I will see you tomorrow. week challenge obviously I'm not gonna be vlogging every single day I've decided to film as much as I can of every couple of days of what I've been eating and how I'm feeling and kind of put them in like a bit of a little montage so today is actually a beautiful day I should have gone out for a run but I decided to stay in and do a workout 
just because I really wasn't feeling like doing anything at all. I had work until 5.30 a.m. last night. I got just over three hours sleep, but I woke up and managed to smash through a full body interval workout. It was about half an hour and I have had a black coffee. I've got my big bottle of squash. Squash in my water really helps me drink it fast, I've realized. I just get through it way quicker when it's got some sort of flavor to it. My arm hurts from the workout. Oh, I'm gonna lean here. For breakfast, I had a plain bowl of Quaker Oats made with water, not milk. It's like half 10 now, I reckon in about an hour, I'm probably gonna make another coffee and see how I'm feeling in terms of snacking. I don't think I'll need to snack before lunch today. I think I'm gonna have lunch at like two, so that's three and a half hours. I think the oats can last me until then, but we'll see. Yeah, I'm just sat down to study. The plan is, I think, to go to the library later, and I definitely wanna get outside at some point today because it's such a beautiful day. But that's my little update, and I'm feeling okay. I'm feeling good, I'm not too tired, and I'm not too hungry. You're gonna be in my vlog. And you've got pineapple for the mess. What did we eat today? With some rice. What rice was it? Spicy. Whole, whole grain Spicy and I'm having a baraka because it's good for mental performance. It's true. Hi, Danielle. Hi. Did you want a baraka? <laughs> Do you guys uh, want a baraka? I'm good. Yeah, I'll have a baraka. Nice. <laughs> and I had a little onion bar, James. Yeah, really nice. Hi guys, so it is currently about half six in the evening and I am just about to start my half an hour of yoga. So I'll just give you a little update on how today has gone. I had a soy coffee at my friend Imogen's while we were revising and then I had another coffee with almond milk in it. And then the only bad thing I've had today is a bottle of Coke. It wasn't Diet Coke, it was normal Coke. I just really needed the sugar and the energy to get me through the revision. My body is feeling good. I'm not too tired from the workout this morning. It wasn't that intense. My legs are hurting a little bit as we did climb all the way up the hill to uni today and I haven't done that in a while because I'm on study leave right now. I woke up this morning with a really bad cramp in the shoulder and it just woke me up completely. I couldn't get back to sleep. I was like trying to do stretches and so hopefully this will help me. This will help my posture as well. And then later, I think maybe at about eight o'clock, I'm gonna have some rice with some avocado and some sauce. Day one is going pretty well. beans, a little sake sauce made from peanut butter, sesame oil, olive oil, and some fresh coriander. And that is my dinner. Blooms! Huh? It's cute, it? is cute, like you! Oh girl! With your curly hair! No. Oh. day four of my five week journey and I'm feeling pretty tired today. It's a Saturday, I had work until half three last night and I woke up this morning at about half ten and I was like I just don't want to do my workout but I'm gonna push myself to do it and drink lots of water to try and get me hydrated and awake but yeah it's going okay I have been sticking to it 100% I haven't gone off the bandwagon yet but I am feeling quite tired but maybe this is just a dip and it'll like come back up again <laughs> let's get on with this workout <laughs>
What just happened? Oh my god. Welcome back. Today is Thursday the 17th, so I'm still in week two, nearing the end of week two. I have a confession to make. I may have messed up just a little bit, and it's only the second week out of five, but the exercise I have kept up. I've still been doing everything every day. I've been finding the time to do it, but unfortunately last night I had a wrap for dinner and then I had some nuts. But then I was going out because I'd just finished my exam and I went to my friend's house and he had some chocolate and some biscuits. And I was so tempted and I just couldn't say no. I just was really craving something sweet. I think it's because I had nuts and every time I have nuts, I either want more of them or I want something sweet afterwards. So I had two custard creams, half of a Kinder Bueno, and then on the way to this party I was going to, I bought a Galaxy chocolate bar, a small one. Yeah, I messed up a little bit. I'm clean eating, I haven't stuck to it. But I think, you know, everyone messes up sometimes. I didn't beat myself up about it. I didn't say I'm gonna restrict myself today because I had chocolate last night. I've just said, right, that happened. I wasn't hungry, but I still ate the chocolate, which was like, not good. But I was saying a couple of days ago how I felt like my metabolism was staying at standstill and that's possibly because I had just been eating so clean. So hopefully my metabolism will boost it a little bit by my little indulgence. I do feel like my metabolism is higher today than it was yesterday. So yeah, I thought I'd just give you a little update on that. It is about 5.30 now, I go to work in about an hour. Today I have just had a lovely day, I woke up late. I've just been relaxing, did a little bit of studying as well, saw my friends, it's a really nice day outside, really sunny. I just had a really nice day chilling and then I just had a shower and I'm gonna get ready for work. I'm gonna eat something before work because I'm working till close, so I'm working seven till it's like 4 a.m. or something. I'm not that hungry because I had a big late lunch. I had like, quinoa with two little beef burgers, a chicken sausage, and some like cauliflower. So I'm not that hungry, that was like half three and it's half five now. And I've just had a Starbucks coffee, you know the little ones you can get in like the shops to give me some energy. I went for a 15 minute run this morning, which was good. And then yeah, I think I'm probably gonna have like a tomato, probably with some nuts, I don't know, I can't bother to cook. But I will show you what I'm having for dinner. And then, yeah, that's the update. Hey guys, what's up? Hey guys, what's up? Uh, sorry, daily vlog. What's up? <laughs> what's up? <laughs> Staying in the park. I don't know how you do this. <laughs> I would be able to vlog but I'd also just like like I would get scared at some points. I'd be able to vlog like 90% of the day but there'll be like some points where like people just be staring at me and I'd be like how do you continue doing this? You better not put this in your vlog. You're gonna put that in your vlog now. <laughs> you can see my bum. Stop me. So you got sleeping. to catch real life. No, you have to, no, this is inspirational. A history <laughs> 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 this is a history. It seem like you've got a really exciting life. No, it's not. But we yes, do it have That's not on my vlog. We are history students at the University of Bristol. <laughs> this is what you're meant to be doing at university. Anybody wants to my phone goes in. Vlog's gonna be well Danielle, are you studying hard? <laughs> Try. I like vlogging, I'm gonna take over. Yeah, this is Emmy's right. part of the vlog. <laughs> hey guys, so we're just in College Green at the moment. Amy's back. Oh, <laughs> this is for Layla's vlog on YouTube. Oh, just <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what did you do? She swore, Chloe, what a shock. That is unacceptable. <laughs> we're just hanging out. It's such a pretty day today. There's lots of people around. And the church is looking lovely. 
and we're just like vlogging and everyone's staring at me but like you've just got to go YOLO if you do what? if you say I'm just doing a vlog I'm just vlogging <laughs> such a lovely day. I'm here with all my friends. Oh I love them so you much. Oh you guys are my best I'm friends. Little... Chloe, do you love Hello, me? Baby <laughs> Hello, baby boy. <laughs> mm. I think it'd be a great vlog. Really. Thank you. Do you think I should start my own YouTube I think account? you should. I think you should. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> do the thing. Oh, wait. Do the thing. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. And cut. <laughs> Bye, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. It is now Sunday. So it's the end of week two of my five week fitness health journey and week two did not go well for me. I've managed to keep up with my exercise which is good. I'm really proud of myself for doing something every day. I've been for a run, I've been doing bar workouts, HIIT workouts, Tabata every single day apart from today and today is Sunday so Sunday is my rest day. Also I've been going to work three days so I went work Thursday Friday Saturday which is just tiring in itself the last two days I finished at like five o'clock in the morning walked home when the sun was rising and just slept until like 11 or 12 so that's kind of messed with my metabolism I haven't been getting the right amount of sleep haven't been getting the right hours of sleep and it's just kind of made me want to eat rubbish I haven't been eating that much so like I had pizza last night after work my boss bought us pizza and who can say no to free pizza and then I've had two packets of crisps today and I had a really healthy breakfast. I had like broccoli on toast, which is actually really good. I know it sounds weird, but it's actually really good. But then all I've had is two packets of crisps. And I'm not hungry, but I know that I've been eating rubbish food. So tomorrow is a new week. I'm gonna try and then just focus more on what I'm eating. Really try and eat healthy food. Next week is my last week before my exam but I am going to be able to hopefully eat some healthy revision snacks and cook up some good meals. Planning on eating a lot of fruit and just like maybe some eggs, you know, healthy stuff like that. I've just done a shop at Tesco's. And yeah, today it's just a really nice day outside. I've just been hanging out with my friends. Went shopping with my flatmate this morning, which was really nice, but we didn't buy anything. We just had a look around. And I think tonight we're gonna have a barbecue, but I'm really not hungry, so I don't know what I'm gonna eat. Probably just like, I don't know. I'm not very hungry at all, it's six o'clock now. Um, but we'll see how we go. I've been drinking a lot of water, because I knew, knew, knew. No, it's important to stay hydrated. Uh, but yeah, I guess I will update you when week three, which hopefully will be a little bit better than week two. Okay, bye guys.